Good morning, guys. We're back at the sawmill. Our lumber yard is just about empty and I need some two by fours. So we're gonna try to get this big log on the mill and see if we can actually mill it down. This log is 24 inches across on the big end and the mill is only supposed to do 20 inches, I think. So it's gonna be interesting to see if this will work or not. It's been so long since we've milled anything. I don't remember what the maximum size is that we could get on there and get cut, but let's see if we can get this big beast cut up. I'm just gonna sit over here and let the boys get that log pulled over here to the mill. But for anybody that was wondering about this fancy white truck, my Jeep is still running, but there are problems with it. It chugs and jerks and does a lot of funky stuff going down the road. So we haven't been driving it. Some point, if things ever lighten up around here, you know, our workload, then we will look into trying to figure out what is wrong with the Jeep. But we got to a point where we couldn't even go down to the corner store with the Jeep. So we picked up this truck for $1,500. And I would say we got our money out of it. We haven't found any problems with it. It runs great. The AC works. The heat works, even though I don't think we really need heat. So that's where this truck came from. It is not four wheel drive, unfortunately. That means we cannot use our driveway that we cut through the trees because it is too muddy to go down it with anything that does not have four wheel drive. get it loaded. Let's see if we can cut it. to take the clamp off long enough for me to get by it because it was sticking out in the way so I, I couldn't get the mill past the clamp. He's going to clamp it back down. This log is definitely a little bit bigger than what this mill was made for.
Well, it's having a hard time getting through this tree, so we're gonna change the blade and see if that'll make a difference. It keeps getting stuck. Uh, the water wasn't running quite right. It, the water kept stopping and starting, and for some reason we're getting a bunch of junk in our lines. I think it's from having well water. But we're gonna change the blade and see if it'll go through this log a little bit easier than what it's doing right now. I realize this log is really big for this mill but the blade just keeps stopping and getting stuck. So let's do that. Honestly, how many of you were yelling at the screen trying to tell Eddie that he was going to run into that? What do you call it? Dog. But it's not called a dog. Somebody yelled at me and they were like, oh, it's not called a dog. It's called uh, 
something. I don't know, but whatever it's called. You can call it a dog, you can call it a post, whatever you call it, I call it. It dealt my blade. But how many of you guys were yelling at Eddie <laughs> to check because he was going to hit it? Well, we got to change. We got to change the blade again and get something to drink. It's really hot out here today. I know it's not hot to some of you guys. It's like 86 degrees. I am sweating. It's hot out here. I'm going to go get a drink and we'll get back to this after we change the blade again. Well, we're back. It's cooled down a little bit, but not raring to go. All those YouTube channels you see that sit out there in the sun and they mill logs all day long and they get through a whole bunch of them. All I can say is they must be younger than us. They definitely have more stamina than us and they're definitely used to this heat and humidity better than we are. Because I'm worn out just doing that little bit. Of course, it's really hard work on the saw. So it's a lot of pushing and it's a lot of work. But we're going to take those slabs, we're going to put them on the mill and cut them up into 2 by 4s now. So let's do it. I'll stand here and watch. How's that? Come on, let's load up them planks. <laughs> just scoot them. So scoot the whole thing that way. Raise them dogs up, as small, short ones as far as they'll go, and then stand up, up on edge. We'll do two at a time. Just two? Yep. Yeah, it'll be easier on the saw if we just do two at a time. Let's see what we got. Look at how low your tire is. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Yeah. Fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-seven. So we got twenty-seven two by fours and four planks. And I don't care what anybody tells you, that is hard work. But this will give me enough two by fours to build my rabbit hutch. That'll be coming up soon, I hope. So many things to do. I appreciate everybody watching. I hope this video wasn't too boring. We'll see you on the next one, guys.